Hey everyone, it's Michelle. Wish everybody had a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. It is January 8th of 2014, and this is my first grocery haul of the year. I went to Kroger and spent $157.70, and this, is, this will last us till next week. I still have to go to Walmart to pick up a few things, but that should only cost about $20. I've got... Um, my budget for each week this year is going to be $200, and then I have a Costco um, shopping trip planned for the end of the month. So, for today, this is what I got. I got these pretzel crisp. I made a, um avocado dip. It's called Raw Ranch, and I found it on Pinterest. And as soon as I um, get some more avocados... I still have some left over, um, but as soon as I make it again, I'll do a video and show y'all. It's really, really good, and I do not like avocados, but I love this dip. Um, so I got these to eat with that. Um, I got some pickle spears for uh, my daughter's lunch and for us to snack on. And these are the ones that are made with sea salt, and they were two for five, and then each of them had a 55 cent coupon, so I got them for three dollars and what 90 cents for both of them um and then there was a 55 percent or 55 percent a 55 cent coupon off of this one too and then i got another bag of my husband's chips for lunch i picked up some organic broccoli florets and some organic lettuce picked up some white american cheese and then my husband and daughter's favorite lunch meat which is the genio um what is it? I done lost my train of thought. Sun-dried tomato. <clears throat> Picked up that. These mushrooms are clearance. They're not organic. But I've also researched that you don't necessarily have to buy organic um, mushrooms because of the way they're cultivated. Um, but I do, when they're on sale, I do purchase them. But these were clearance for $1.09, and they're good until the 14th. So I picked up those. Picked up an organic English cucumber. Picked up some organic lemons. We're, tonight we're having lemon, pepper, chicken, parmesan pasta. That's a mouthful. Um, I picked up some of this orange juice. The hamburger meat, the simple truth, hamburger meat was on sale for $5.99 a pound, I believe. So I picked up one of those. And then I picked up two of these um, simple truth thinly sliced chicken breasts. That's for our supper tonight. I picked up two organic tomatoes, three organic limes. Um, these are for my kids' lunches. Picked up some minced garlic and some paper plates, some organic ketchup, some organic um, carrot puree, baby food. I put this in our mac and cheese. It's an extra. It's a way to get extra vegetables, and it's really really good. <clears throat> picked up some Purell sanitizing stuff for my hands to keep in my, um, what is it, purse. Picked up a little pencil sharpener because our big one is not working good. Banana, um, organic bananas. And then I picked up two things of organic um, chicken stock. Two things of these oat, this oatmeal. I don't normally get Mom's Best. I normally get the Simple Truth, but they were out of the Simple Truth today, so I had to pick up these. Um, I'll talk about that in a minute. I got some Hormel Natural Choice um, pepperonis. These are uncured, so they have no nitrates or no nitrites. I got um, some uncured beef hot dogs. We don't eat a lot of hot dogs, but this is good to have. Like if you have leftover chili, to have chili dogs the next day or just have a quick lunch on the weekends. I got some um, uncured bacon. A gallon of chocolate almond milk, a half a gallon of vanilla almond milk, and a half a gallon of whole regular milk. I got this container of um, Greek yogurt. We're going to start using Greek yogurt in place of sour cream. It's very healthy for you, and it's it actually tastes good. And then we got this for, <clears throat> for the kids, their chicken nuggets. They were on sale, um, plus I had a 75 cent off coupon. Um, so Dylan will have these tonight instead of what everybody else is having. And then I had, I found this and I've been looking, um, I can't remember who has the brand 
think it's Smithfield that does the brand for the other sausage that we get. But it's not in patties like this. And we always like it <clears throat> to be the no MSG, no nitrates, no, you know, anything added like that. And I found this at Kroger and I was so happy. Um, these are preservative free, so there's no MSG. Um, let's see. Show you the ingredients. And it was only, it was on sale for I think $5.99. Let's see. Um, these are the ingredients. I don't know if it will back up. Maybe there's a light. Let's see if it will. Does it will. No. Oh, whoa. Okay. Anyways, I'll read to you what it is. It says pork, water, salt, spices, and sugar. Minimally processed, no artificial ingredients. Then over here it says no fillers, no MSG, and always gluten free, which we like the gluten free. Fresh pork, no fillers, preservative free, gluten free, no MSG. So, <clears throat> in just a minute, I'll open. So, I'm very excited to find this because Saturday mornings we usually have a big breakfast unless we have something going. We usually have um, oh, bacon and sausage, gravy and biscuits and. You know, stuff like that. So, this is um, really, really good. Plus, it's easier to cook in the mornings. And I think this will taste better. So, anyways, that's my grocery haul for today. It was one fifty-seven seventy. dollars I need to close those drawers. One fifty-seven seventy. Oh, I didn't talk about the dog food. Thank you. Okay. Our dog, Stella, she is a Beagle and a Dotson mix. She looks like that. And no, that's a that's a lab. Um, she has we've had her for five years. She's going on two years old. We rescued her from our um, local animal shelter, and um, she has seizures probably two to three times a year. Nothing major. They're not violent seizures. She doesn't um, foam at the mouth or convulge or start trying to bite or whine or anything. She does her whole body shake. She does kind of space out. Um, but she's already had two this year. So I've been doing research. And honestly, I don't think it's it's brain injury. Um, just because she doesn't have them that often. I think it may have to do something with her thyroid or um, something simple like that. I'm hoping like her diet. She, <laughs> she's gotten fat. She has, she eats. <laughs> our leftovers and everything like that so we have completely taken her off of table scraps um she has one of her teeth needs to be removed because it's gotten rotten and it's wiggly so she goes to the vet next week for blood work and everything so i decided to change her food and i found this at kroger it's the newman's organic and it has um it's high protein and yes it has grains and i want it i want to take her completely off of grains but I want to try this first and I also want to try it with this which I found you keep it in the refrigerator it's called fresh pet select slice and serve and it's the chicken vegetable and rice recipe and what I'll do is I'll take you know just a, an eighth of a pound or a quarter of a pound and I'll mix it with her dry dog food and um, hopefully that getting her off of all the preservatives and um, just bad stuff that's in dog food. Um, hopefully this will help her. But anyways, we go to the vet next week, um, to get her checked out. So, this is my Kroger haul today. I plan on going to Walmart tomorrow, so I will, um, fill y'all in on my grocery haul tomorrow. This was one of my Christmas presents from my sister, and I absolutely love them. They, she got them at Kirkland's. And they are, um, they're adorable. I love owls. I do too. This is sugar and brown sugar and flour. So, aren't they cute? Anyway, so that's my grocery haul. I hope everyone has a wonderful weekend. I will see y'all later.